Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the great El Salvador turned into the Central American Empire. Where, at this point, well, we're kind of at war with Colombia, which is good in the fact that they have a lot of manpower we can use in the end. But, in uh, in the same way, yeah, we're, we're suffering a lot of attrition. We don't have a lot of supply here, which is important. But, 100% still winnable war, I can, I can assure you. They have a fleet sitting there, apparently. We won something. We sank four of their destroyers. Okay, very nice. And of course, Colombia can't even get any of their trade resources out because we are raiding their convoys just about everywhere. Everywhere that they have, you know, any sort of place to make sure that they can't be raided. Over here, we're kind of... I guess we're kind of... Repairing our ships? Okay, yeah, you're, you're currently repairing, so that's okay. So that's, they have like... One thing they can do here. And apparently Columbia owns that? No, Netherlands owns that. That's even stranger than Columbia owning it, so... Okay, that's fine. Alright, let our organization bring itself back up. Very, very slowly just because of our supply, but... I'm sure it can be fixed. I'm sure it can be fixed. Everything can be fixed all the time. All in good time. Now, of course, they are heavily defending their capital. Which means we're going to have to make most of the offenses, uh, the offensives on everything else. All they have, probably, I'm guessing about uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, that's 11, 13, 17, 18. 18 divisions here. Okay. They have 18 divisions there. On the bright side, we're going to be setting this to maximum. Set reinforcements down so we can just set up some fresh troops. Ready to be done. Civili oh my god, Soviet Union just capitulated to the German Reich. That is ridiculous. Oh my god. I have never seen it happen before and I didn't think this would be the day. This is, an, this is a historical moment. This, this is a historical moment. Gotta appreciate this, really. I don't know how it happened. But Germany just did a better Germany than I could ever Germany. Common turn exists only as Mongolia and as Finland which shouldn't have, learned, shouldn't have uh, lost in the first place but that's A-OK -okay, I guess since they're going to be destroyed anyways this conference is over calculating effects alright because the war with the Soviets is completely over now oh okay the German Reich took 133 states, uh, states. jeez oh, this is, this is kind of disgusting uh, I, I don't know what to say I don't know what to say, but this is, this is, uh, I'm guessing the United States is in a little bit of trouble now. Uh, especially since I'm going to start invading Mexico and, you know, just about everything else. But yeah, I can 100% say that this is, uh, disgusting and that America's going to be in trouble. I can also say that it's going to be very difficult for me to actually bust my way through here. Let's grab some better support artillery. It's a better artillery in general, I suppose. They probably have higher technology in certain aspects than I do, which is why they're winning some things. I'm guessing it's because of obviously low supply, which is going to decrease our attack significantly. Significantly destroying our attack because of that low supply. I wonder if there's a way if we can grab supply from something. Because I don't suppose there would be ways there. Supply areas. Is there a way to, like, fix this or something, or cause this is 22 out of 14. Previous bottleneck, which is Honduras. Ports from Honduras are bringing over our supply. This is going to be difficult to win. Gotta say. Uh... Okay. Well. Hmm. First of all, stop, stop attacking first. I want you guys to chill. Just sort of chill, right? Regain your strength. Build yourselves back up. After which we're going to do a mass assault just along the capital. Literally just a 100% mass assault. Uh, in fact, that might be a bad idea. Hold on, that's a mountain. But if we can win this battle, we can definitely win a battle against them. 
Actually, that, that's not necessarily true at all. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Very wrong. Okay, let's think. What can we, what can we do here? Uh, artillery is our only problem right now. Need more artillery. That's what we need. Let's go over to production. Artillery and motorized is very, very important for us right now. We can get our maximum possible efficiency. In fact, we can get over 100% efficiency, which, you know, totally makes sense. 100%. Okay, we're actually going to be doing this. We're doing this instead. We're going to be grabbing more people. Fresh armies. Okay, you guys are actually so attrition that I'm not sure you guys will last very long at all, so... I do need you to do. Actually, no, just st stand here for now. Guys, st st stand back. So chill. Everyone in here. Everyone must be here. Only when you're done invading can you, uh,. Can you sort of chill, alright? Because I want everyone invading. I want one spearhead directed into there. Not really from there, but uh, no, that's actually dangerous to do. Well, it seems we're in a bit of a pickle. Hmm. What do we do? What should we do? We should grab for these guys and send them to a new army along with these guys and sort of get them back into business in Mexico. Of course. Because, well, there's not really much we can do here. Uh, let's, um, you know, back up over there. That's fine. It is, in theory, possible for us to get their capital. Possibly. If we can get everyone here, that is. That was the worst idea I think I've ever had. Okay, never mind. Just do, just do this thing. Just go and, you know, just, just do, just do the, the regular thing, I guess. Whatever. Stop your orders. Then go do what you need to do. Uh, we have so much better power here. We could. Uh, no, it's not important. We could grab some new things. How did I not have a fascist pentagon and still change? I don't even know, dude. Oh well. Okay, let's do some. Let's do some things here. Right. Armor. We have like nothing. All these are literally just completely garbage for us. We don't need any of them. Trip designer. For perhaps a. No, it's not important. It's not important. I shall focus then. Uh, of course, let's go for nuclear effort. Okay, every time I click a button, bad things happen, so I need to stop clicking buttons. Clearly. Another thing that I think needs to happen is that I need to sort of chill. With what's going on here? Because a lot of my divisions are just dying from attrition. Like it's literally just just attrition. So that's one of our biggest problems. Don't try and cut us off. They probably can't get there in time. If they do, then that might be it for us. That being said. Oh, okay. I need you guys over there immediately. Because I just did the worst thing in the world. Got my entire army killed. The only unfortunate thing about this is that I have so many more people that it just doesn't... Like, our, our existence is not entirely crippled by it, but, like, it's just... Duh. It's sort of like a... Ugh, not again. Sort of thing, you know. What? 
to my bed. It's sort of like an eh. We, can, we might be able to hold out for a little while, but probably not that much. All right, no, don't don't fight him. Sit back. We have him to walk away. Hold on. Look at their revenge. So you guys take a while. Okay. Did you can you get war with anyone? Well, let's, let's run your faction. I don't care. Now oh, there we go. Now we can finally push through. Then, uh, on that note, push through from the other side. Oh, let me join the allies. Oh God, no! I joined a faction. The bad things happen. Oh God, no! Hold on. Well, I didn't call my faction leader in. Does it matter? Arms from Cyan. Uh, um, I mean, okay. I mean, yeah, of course. Huh. Yeah, okay, that was a bad idea. And out of anything I'm gonna do in this entire game, loading a save? That's 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 gonna be the time. That's literally gonna be the only time. I forgot when you join a faction. Your enemy is probably going to join a faction too. Gotta remember that. Sometimes, you know, when your head just cut, you just gotta remember some, some things. So let's, you know, not join a faction. And in fact, we're currently able to cover our entire army. Because they're going to stay here. No, no, no capturing along that area. We need you guys to guard that. On some divisions. Yeah, just do your thing over there. Hmm, hmm. Well, on the bright side, we managed to save this. But on the not bright side, uh, we're not going to lose this war, probably. Oh, shouldn't say that. Should say maybe that it's going to be difficult, and. Well, actually, we have supply now. So hold on, this might actually not be as bad as I imagined it would be. Because we actually have supply. Somehow it's getting through. Previous. Bottleneck. It's no longer our problem. Okay. Right, so here we are about to fight an actual efficient war now that we have things. You guys are suffering attrition because you're moving, I think. That's your biggest issue. It's, oh, okay, it's very hot and it's the jungle. I understand that then. That's, uh, that's understandable. Okay, now with actual supply, perhaps, I don't even know how the supply got, got through, but, you know, maybe with actual supply we can, uh, get something done here. Let's do an assault. We're gonna be going in here, surrounding them. Perhaps we'll be able to get there in time, even before they can put that guy there. If not... Ah, okay. Strategic use. Yes, hold the patriotic speak. speech. Okay, so we gotta do other things, like that thing that we just did, which was tank designer. No, it wasn't. Ship designer. Yes. Not that. And uh, national. No, no faction. Uh, let's do some nuclear effort. Attack we are losing, unfortunately. Two different sides. Is it two different attacks? It should be one, it should be one attack, actually. What's two different attacks? I have no clue. Oh, there we go. It's literally just two artillery, and we're losing it. What? Oh my god, okay, what's your uh, You guys have a lot of defense, that's why. You guys are entrenched, and you have tons and tons of defense. And our attack is not what's your defense is. But your defense is more than our attack is. That's why you are winning. So although we have our full width, you guys have more soft attack and more defense than we have soft attack and defense. Okay, so maybe that's basically just because of our artillery and the way it works. So we need to get better artillery, I think, is the biggest concern right now. It's not, it's not just about having the artillery, it's about having better artillery, because we're extremely out of date with our artillery. Ah, oh, salvaging, salvaging games, uh, it's, not, it's not a lot of fun, because, you know... All those bad things that you did in the beginning that kind of messed up on, huh, you get to you get to fix those. And sometimes that just means being garbage for a little while until you can get things rolling. So let's get our artillery going. 
after we get that done, we need more artillery. In fact, we can probably get artillery up into advanced artillery, which we should have had in the first place, because right now we have regular artillery. This artillery, check right here. Defense, 10. Assault attack, 25. This is what they have, probably, 18 and 34, while we have 10 and 25. Yeah, and they have more breakthrough. That's, that's kind of ridiculous. We're sort of bad at what we do, apparently. In the meantime, uh, we should, perhaps, other, other than artillery, grab some different support equipment and other things like that. Actually, we should be able to grab, uh, well, it's hard attack and piercing, so we want kind of this thing. Support weapons and equipment and all that stuff. All the good things we need. Having people just isn't enough. We just need to wait and drain out what they own. Break down their strength, really. Because our organization is going to break first, but their strength is going to break. Actually, no, our strength is going to break first, too. We're just actually fighting losing battle. Well, we'll still fight. Hold on. Uh, everyone here can fight at the same time. That should be a good W. If it's not, then I don't even notice it. Remarkable. Not even with all of our people, do what we need to. So perhaps the real reason is because we have garbage artillery, and artillery is one of the biggest things that we have. And of course, our motorized divisions are also garbage because we also have bad artillery, and because we also have badges, but everything else too. Did we not get that uh, that other thing? That um, production. Well, the motorized, what was it, mechanized? Did I not grab that? No, I got the new weapons rather than mechanized, and I probably should have grabbed the mechanized instead of the advanced weapons. Sometimes things don't go the way you plan, which is why bad things happen, but... When I thought this would be an easy war, it just turned out to be just kind of a stillmate, really. Uh, they have the same division as I do, probably. So, yay, stillmates, that's fun. That's a whole lot of fun, yeah. Okay. Let's grab a, let's grab one more division. Let's grab you guys up to how many do you have? You have two, so I want you guys to get one more. To get a third one. And that'll be ten divisions, so that'll bring you to twenty four with that. Okay. This might be a better idea. Actually, no, don't activate it yet. I thought there was no toggle activation. Just like activate, and that's it. Activate, that's the, that's the whole game. That's the whole thing. I want you guys to get there, and then I want you guys to like just be a defending force for now. You guys can get your organization up under there. Which we're mobilizing? Uh, some amount per day. Losing a lot per day, though. Manpower. I'm sure, their manpower doesn't do so well. No, no, their manpower is fine. Okay. That's what they have. Extensive conscription. Well, I have also extensive conscription. Okay. Okay. It's a couple of them. Not you, for, for some reason. No. Oh, right, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, let's set them to, to here. Okay, and then... Now, this is not talking a lot, but it's, you know, it's, it's called focusing. Just don't, don't go any more, though. It's also called the fact that I'm doing so badly in this campaign, I feel like I'm Italy. Oh my god. Wow. Is this what it felt to be, uh, to be Italian in World War II? Maybe. You know, being bad in general. Yeah, that's kind of what it is. Because they have no weak points in their defense. I mean, neither do I, but like, come on. Throw me a bone here. Gotta give me something. Stability is decreasing too. Come on. Throw me a bone here. Alright. 
Our divisions are getting into place. Increasing their organization. Why are you mad? What do you want? Waiting for equipment to be produced and delivered. 51 total artillery. There. Okay, let's actually cancel that line entirely so we have enough manpower to keep fighting. Oh, apparently that's supposed to be a, a good plan. Alright, let's help them out. Poor artillery. We're gonna just keep driving our way down the artillery. artillery yeah, artillery. Funny there, I would like. I would uh, appreciate it if you guys fought there. It's possible that we could win this just because of existing. But at the same time, I don't know. Man. At the same time, it's not really working as, as well as I thought it would. <sighs> Dude, mountains, honestly. Okay, uh, can I take them there? No. Is that a good idea? No. Uh. Okay, first time. Can we grab maybe some. I don't know, secret weapons? Oh no. You guys can sit there, regroup a little bit. Oh, did I see a little bit of uh, a little bit, a little bit of green there? Huh? Is it a little a little bit of green? A little bit of green? Ah, uh, okay, just just for a second then. Okay, let's get our doctrine done through, done through, done too as well. Critical population apparently is literally just like the best thing in the world. If you just keep pumping out people through it. When you're currently winning, then you lose points. Nice. Well, I mean, they are losing a lot of equipment and other such things. Well, we're on a little bit of an advantage. I'm not gonna lie, we are on a little bit of an advantage there. But at the same time, don't need you. Don't need you. Definitely don't need you. It's kind of like, are you guys? No. Don't need that. Don't need that. Nope, okay. Don't need you, don't need you, or you, or you, or you. I'm sure let's grab some land aircraft, why not? We don't have aircraft, but at some, at some point I'm sure we're gonna want some. I don't know. I'm sure at some point in the world we're gonna want some aircraft, huh? Whatever you do, do not let them resupply. We cannot let them resupply and reorganize. Even if it means that we ourselves will become unorganized and uh, kind of a little bit low on, on some things, but it's important that we just literally just keep mowing them down. No, not mowing them down, but you know, just draining them slowly, I guess. <sighs> we should have been producing better artillery earlier, honestly. These guys here, help them, help them out. You guys are gonna take a while to get there, aren't you? Because you have to cross a river into a hills, so that's good. Except for these three guys, actually. I want you guys to stay here to help out with this. Actually, no, I want you all to stay here because you guys seem to be having a little bit of trouble. There. I don't even know what I'm hearing. Random things I could be hearing outside my house. That's weird. Well, come on, I just need you guys to uh, like get rid of some. Some things like what is this? Infantry template two. Die, I, I guess. I don't know. Organization? Yes, yes. Drop your organization. You need lots of organization within your entire existence. Drop your organization. Come on, so close, so close. Drop your organization. Okay, they're close to having no organization. Yes, yes. Very good, very good. Very low strength as well. I mean, so do we. But hey, we gotta like get through this. We gotta get rid of them. The one artillery down, it'll just start being a little bit of a uh, snowball effect. Once one artillery's down, the next one's gonna fall faster. Then after that, the next one. And then the next one. Oh, wait, no, they just come back with more. 
Understandable. Well, this isn't going as expected. Not, not really even slightly. Oh god, no, I don't want to take that. You actually have more defenses than I do. Actually, no, we have more defenses on the front line than they do. <sighs> Our defenses are very, very weak right now. Oh god, this is just not working out really, is it? Hmm. Let's see, what's the problem here? What's the problem here? We have divisions attacking at the wrong time. We've got everyone attacking at the same time. Currently, we're currently winning, and now we're currently losing. And that was the problem. Let's check. We have more to use combat with. Their infantry has 71 soft attack, 12 heart attack, 221 defense because of base value of 159. Well, mine have a base value of. 42.6. Seriously? Well then. Maybe we should change up what we have here. In fact, uh... Okay. There's over a special force limit. Would it... Would it really... Do we have any Mountaineers really... I'm there. I'm there. So no, we're, we're kind of good actually, so. Oh right, because if we just add one, then it applies it to a whole bunch, so. That's understandable actually. Back to the note, let's uh, change that back. Artillery. No, uh, Mountaineers. 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 We want 20 width. Mountaineers. Artillery. Boom. Done. Train them up. Oh, no, not like that. Train them up. Like that. Ah, uh, no, Costa Rica. They're gonna take a while, but once they get here, they might prove to be extremely effective. And, uh, if not, well, uh, I don't know what to tell you. We're losing every single battle. Makes me wonder if it's worth to continue fighting other than to just drain their supplies when we can. This one spearhead might be enough, but at the same time, I'm not sure if it'll like destroy us. Well, I don't want you guys fighting on two different ones. Fight one or fight none. I want you guys all here. You guys, of course, are already fighting in there. There. Let's see where you guys go. We've got one, or no, they have everyone moving. Basically, they're like three divisions. Okay, so they are following where I'm going. Okay. Infantry anti tank will give us a lot more of those. Let's grab some. Okay, my nice equipment. I guess that's across the river, so of course I understand it'll take you guys a long time to get there, but once you do get there, it might actually be uh, pretty pretty effective once you do. So let's, let's see what let's see what let's see what happens. We can grab this province, maybe, and then double attack on that province. Keep it a little bit garrisoned here. I have to keep one there, obviously. Okay, so we're almost there. We got very very close. Right. Want everyone focused on it. Everyone. Literally everyone. No one gets stop. Who's running away? Stop. Okay, there. Stay there. At this rate. At this current rate. You I want you to I want you to stop doing that. I want you to literally just sit there. I want you to defend that. That's it. That's it. That's your, that's your entire job. Easy peasy. That's your job. 
It's for you guys, you have literally one job, and that is to attack the mountains and not get absolutely pummeled. But somehow, somehow, it managed to happen to you anyways. So let's do that other thing where we leave one guy here. Attach from his orders. Bring him in there. That one guy's attached from his orders, we'll stay here. Attack from two different areas, perhaps that'll allow us to get a little bit of more of an edge, a little bit of an edge at all, maybe? We're at our full 120. We are doing our best, but clearly this is just not breaking. That artillery of theirs is just ridiculous. So much attack just from that artillery. <sighs> okay. Base value of 77. Well, we have a base value of not very much. They have more attack than we do. Oh, wait, no, that makes sense in some, in some capacity. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Get everything here. <sighs> 130 troops can't defeat three. Five, really. Not even troops or divisions. Things are different with that. But honestly, though, seriously. So we got we have better artillery, so we're going to keep going down the artillery road. Artillery 2. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should make things a little bit better for us. Same time, I don't even know what's going on. Let's stay here. Stay, 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 stay there. Okay. We're going to have to uh, think of something here. We could create a faction. Now, it might be a bad idea, because although they would join the faction, uh, that kind of creates a problem where the allies probably will join against me. That's an issue. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 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 How's time going? Man, this war's been going on for so long, and it just cannot seem to get things done. But, it has been so long during this episode, just literally just going for war. And I guess that means that we'll have to wait until the next episode to get some more of it done. It might not be a very large Central American Empire when we are finished, but it will be one, damn it, and it will happen. So, I'll catch you guys in the next Great El Salvador episode.